Hey, it's Gareth from Port Monkeys, and we're in the city of Seward, Alaska. And we are um, going to just take a little walk. So here's Ray's waterfront dining. There's a True Value Hardware, the Breeze Inn Motel. This is snow. I mean, it's, I'm sure it's been plowed over here, but as you can see, there's snow all around us. There's two ships there. The Regent Seven Seas Explorer is right in front, and our ship, the Carnival Luminosa, is behind it. So we've walked around to here. To this point, it's about a mile from the ship, a little bit less. And there's Janet. And I'm gonna look at this. And there's this handy boardwalk. And no shortage of people. Of course, there's no shortage of restaurants either. And souvenir pennies. And souvenir shops. And those big lines. Orca. And of course, snow capped mountains, but you're already seeing that, aren't you? It is beautiful here. Just beautiful. And there's tickets, tickets. Tickets. Kenai Fjords Tours. And there's Sunny Cove Sea Kayaking. So there's lots of opportunity, I imagine, to book a tour once you get off the ship. Although I might book it in advance. We've crossed over from Japan, across the Pacific, and it rained non-stop. I don't know what these guys are. And it never cleared up, even one day. Even one day, it did not clear up. And then today, it's sunny. Sunny. I'm gonna name that eagle Sunny. I'm gonna name these bears. Boo Boo and Yogi. And I'm going to name that salmon Dinner. So, thank you to the Seward Fishing Charter Fleet. Thank you to our partners. I guess this is where they Hoist up the big ones and take your picture. Let's go out around here. Hmm. I'm thinking it's low tide. Stroke, <laughs> stroke, watch out for that pier. Hey, who's that? <laughs> I think they're learning how to row. <laughs> I hope they're learning how to row, because they really don't know. So we came from over there to the right, came out on this point of land here. There's bathrooms. This is the Seward Mariner's Memorial. And look, Janet's here. And it's a, it's a nice little memorial. Let's walk inside real quick. And of course, there's the ship. And the other ship. They look about the same size, but the Luminosa is twice the size. Oh! So our destination is over there. That's the end of town. So 
you can see the ship over there. We come all the way around there. This is a campground, but I don't see anybody camping here. And it says there's a dead end here. But I think maybe that's for uh, cars, vehicles. We're gonna find out. I see a lot of people up ahead. But I guess you can see the mountains pretty clearly, although clouds are starting to come in. It's supposed to rain tonight, but I think we'll be gone by the time it starts raining. I don't know. Outhouses. Snow on the ground. It's not been plowed. see what this no parking this side potable water park parallel beyond this point I wonder if this gets really crowded in here in the summer play in the snow? Hmm? Play in the snow? not me secret? I do. Do you promise not to tell? Yes. 813. Remember that number. Is it the magic? It comes right after or right before 812. So we've come over as far as the Lowell Creek Waterfall. And that's it. And there was just a bald eagle flying around up there. But I don't see him now. But we're going to go down to that beach. And see what there is to see in the water there. Last time we were here, there were people fishing for salmon. There were salmon trying to get up there. I don't think they could make it, but you know, maybe there's another way. Anyway, there's a car coming. Ready? and rock fall zone. I don't know if we can get down over here. Looks like a trail though. The way we did it last time. Last time we were here, this beach was covered with jellyfish, you know, dying in the sun. Not sure why they were here. 
Not sure why the seagulls are here. And then there looks like a fishing boat over there. Life Center was over there, the waterfall. We walked back out to the water. So you can see this. Um, this might be the best best viewing spot around. Uh, it, it's huge. You know, I mean, it's, it's huge. And there's snow-capped mountains all around. There's the ships, right? So from Seward, Alaska, 